Don't mind me. I'm just in my greenhouse, laying down that soul sand, getting one step closer to being the potion man. A few episodes ago, you saw a glimpse of my greenhouse. It's nothing too special, but this is what it looks like. Before, this area was just outside. I only had wheat. I extended it a lot. Took about an hour to put this together. Nothing too fancy, but it gets the job done. I only had 13 of these things, but once they grow, I have a full garden. I have more than I can ask for. I got tons of sugar cane. I got pumpkins. I'm trying to get them to grow right next to it. I'm trying. I think I'm gonna extend this greenhouse and make it multiple levels. Just keep growing. It just looks better being all in one place instead of having this ghetto sugarcane fence. I got sugarcane all along the sides. Time to get to work. I didn't risk my life for nothing. I didn't go down to the nether for nothing. Give me that brewing stand putting those blaze rods to use. Why not lay this down right next to the anvil? Anvil, brewing stand, enchanting table, fire. This room is fire. Look at this. This room is fire. Finally, I got the enchantment I wanted. Had to use four books, level one, to get this thing to pop up. No more worrying about arrows. I can go down to the nether, stay as long as I want flame power and infinity. That's nice. That, that's beautiful. I'm almost ready to get going. Get a little sneak peek of my tree farm right there. But it's time to find a village. I've tried to go out my own way. I've gone to different biomes and I've gone this way, that way, left, right, north, south, west, east. There's just nothing around me, so I gotta go, I gotta go really far. I'm gonna use the nether, and then that way. Oh look, there's a villager right there! What? Speaking of villagers, I'ma kidnap that man. Oh, oh, that's not a villager. What what is that? I've never seen that guy before. How did he get there? Who is that guy? That's not a villager? <laughs> What is this guy doing here? Oh, he want, he doesn't want none of this. What, what? Oh, oh, oh. Let me get out of here. He doesn't want any of this. He doesn't want this. Oh, you just hit the cat. You hit the cat. I'm the potion man. This is my territory. Get down to the ground. Ooh, 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 I'm the only guy around here that can slang those potions. Come on, cat. Do something, cat. Cat. See, that's why I need some wolves. But I can't find wolves. That's why I'm gonna use the nether. I'm gonna travel far, make another portal, and hopefully it puts me in a new area. They create new blocks that I haven't been to before. Because I, my seed, it can't just not have a village or wolves. That doesn't make any sense. They have to be there. And I, I've traveled, I've gone west, I told you. There's nothing there. I see different biomes, but I never see what I wanna see. So that's the strategy. It's time to get to beasting and feasting. Look at that. That's a beautiful sight. When you come to your farm and you see, oh, I'm making a splash. I'm making a splash out here. I'm getting threes, I'm getting twos. Nothing less than two. Remember I had, I think I had 12 or 13. Now I got 23 and this is only on one eight block farming section. Not even the other side yet. Let's get to, let, let's make these potions. Here's my first recipe. About to change that water into something deadly. I got plenty for that magma cream. I got a whole bunch of slime balls. Look at this. I'm about to go down there and slice and dice some more of those things. I need more of these. It's time to be immune to fire. This is gonna be nice. Now I have a reason to use redstone. I have so much redstone, I never use it. And now I have a reason to use it. So this is good. I have stacks on stacks on stacks. This is crazy. I went from three minutes to eight minutes. Eight minutes of fire resistance. That is some cheese. I'm gonna be cheesing in Minecraft. I'm ready to go. I got everything I need. I got fire resistance. 
the leash just in case I see some horses over there. I got bones in case I find some wolves. I'm getting something I don't have already, that's for sure. I did put in work down here. I got cobblestone as the walkway. That way in case the gas pops out of nowhere, at least I don't have to worry about falling all the way down into lava. Now, I'm on level 45 right now, but according to the comment section, I was in the fake nether because I'm not high enough. But I ain't mad. I don't really want to see gas anyway. I think this is the perfect time to give this bow a try. Let's see what this thing is made of. First shot. Oh, a one hit kill. Wow. I got that power now. You don't want to mess with me. You don't want to. Oh, that's not that's not a one hit kill. Ooh, I think I got to aim for the head. If I aim for the head, one shot and they're dead. I got that stopping power now. <laughs> I might even have to mess with these zombie pigmen. You guys better stop getting too close. Better stop looking at me. If I don't like the way you're looking at me, I'm gonna let this bow fly. What are you gonna do? This is a one hit kill to the head. <laughs> this is just me being cautious. I know I'm safe down here because I've been here before. It's safe. Look at these guys. They're, they're looking at me. I, I don't like how you're looking at me. Stop looking at me like that. I, I might just have to pull out the bow. But I'm just being cautious by making this walkway. Just, just in case there's some cheese. This is a good spot for another portal. I'm very far from the other portal. So that means I should be very far in the real world. Just take me away. Show me something good. No, why? Why, why am I in a cave? No, I don't want to be. I want to be on grass. I want to be up there so I can get some wolves. I can't get wolves down here. I got diamonds on me right now, so I have to be this cautious. If lava or something falls here, I should be good. I'll just, I'll just make a smooth move. I'll cross over to the right. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Ah, I hit water. That's not good. All right, I'm gonna go back down and go to the other side of the cave and then try to dig up again. And hopefully that takes me to the surface. I hit water again. So let's see. Let's see if it's just a waterfall in the cave. I mean, if it is, I'll just dig around it. I know this cave keeps going because I hear all these mobs. They're next door, so I can go next door if I have to. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Ah, this is bad. I'm in the middle of the ocean. Come on, I I'm in the middle of the, that is the worst spawn ever. I gotta go back. What I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna go back to the area before I get here where I climb up the ladder and I'm just gonna put the portal there and hopefully, oh, whoa, 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 oh, oh! Out of nowhere, potion, cheese! I got that potion! You don't want it with me, take that! Oh, wait a second, take that! Oh, a one-hit kill! Killing the gas with one hit! One-hit knockout! Mayweather versus Pacquiao, it's going down! This is a preview! Oh, -hoo -hoo. woo! This potion cheese, oh, I can't, I can't take that out? That sucks. I might as well just use this on all these guys. Actually, now that I think about it, if I use this potion, I can go to the spawner and just sit there when they spawn, hit them, hit them, hit them, get like a million blaze rods. That'll be my blaze rod farm. I'll use the potion to farm. One potion, eight minutes. How many, how many blaze rods can you get in eight minutes? I don't even know. That is crazy. See, I knew it's a smooth move to build that platform because even though I was safe before, I had a feeling, man, I had a feeling that I was gonna get hit with some cheese. He, he literally popped out of nowhere. No warning, just boom. Let's go get him. Oh, oh, that's a spawner. This is beautiful. I'm gonna have all the blaze rods that I need. This is exactly what I was looking for. 
I've got to get creative. What, what do you think I should do with this spawner? How do you think I should set up this blaze rod farm?